What is up guys? All right, on my last video I showed you my uh, battle fighting Colonel First in this Alliance War. I finished him off with 47 seconds left, which I thought was pretty good until my man Joe here uh, used my strategy, except he tweaked it just a little bit and beat the guy with a minute and four seconds left. So we're gonna take a quick look at Joe's attack, see what he did differently, and take a couple of tips from him because I think uh, my strategy plus his little tweak of it has really brought this uh, method even closer to perfection. And, and I really think, uh, you know, how often do you see bases like this that are almost a max level 11 taken out with a minute left? It's, uh, it's rare, it, probably, you know, extremely rare, whatever units are used. Um, so we're going to look at Joe's attack and, and talk about why he cut off so much time from his attack time. Not to mention he used less skill points uh, than I used. So let's see what he did differently. And uh, I, I'll kind of add an exception to a rule that I mentioned a couple videos ago about the gunship. Why it's too slow, blah, blah, blah. Well, there's an exception to that rule. And Joe's going to show you what happens here in a little bit. Basically, from, from the start, his attack was just like mine. Uh, he's a lightning strike, AT-4 launcher on the communication center. Lightning strike again up top on the right. So far, everything's the same. Uh, now, when he goes to the gunship, here's the difference. And I'm going to pause it for a second. Whenever, well, we'll let it play slow. Whenever he's taking out the, uh, the comm center with the gunship, he doesn't exit out whenever he gets to the 25 millimeter ammo and he keeps using them. And, and that's a great idea in this situation because, well, we've already used a lightning strike down here. This same turret down in the corner is almost gone. This same turret right here and this bunker are almost gone. So really, instead of exiting out of the gunship and using extra skills to take out those to either disable them with the EMP artillery or an AT4 launcher, why not just finish them off with the uh, 25 millimeter cannon, save yourself some uh, skill points, and by destroying them completely instead of using EMP artillery, your dragon fires or other units don't actually have to go down there to destroy them. So that basically saves your dragon fires from hitting a bunch of mines, which is what happened to me, and probably the reason that I didn't beat this base in a minute as well, because my dragon fires got destroyed by mines, uh, and I'm sure you guys saw that video. So yeah, the, literally the only difference in our attacks is that he used his 25 millimeter cannon to take out the bunker and those two SAM turrets. Uh, and it looks like whenever he fought the guy, he had a, a SAM, a, a SAM turret up here that was completed. It wasn't completed when I fought him, but uh, yeah, that was pretty much it. And then he dropped his uh, warbird to protect his dragon fires and let the dragon flyers fly. So. That was it. He used some different ground troops than me. I, I'll still argue. I think uh, I think the ones that I use are faster, but um, clearly his were extremely effective as well. Uh, and I'm probably going to start using in this scenario the gunship. I mean, I don't think uh, the gunship with the 25 millimeter cannon is is ideal for taking out a SAM turret that's 100%. You know, has all of its HP. In that case, it would take you a long time, and and using the EMP artillery is probably faster than using a 25 millimeter gunship to take out the SAM turrets. But uh, yeah, in the case that there's only a little bit of HP left on your SAM turrets and maybe a bunker, then go for it. Use the rest of the, the gunship and uh, use that 25 millimeter ammo to really quickly take out those remaining uh, turrets and save yourself a bunch of time and skill points and check it out. A minute four left. Uh, great job, Joe, and I'm, I'm probably going to start using that when I come across uh, this scenario.